So, Dr. Gordon and I want to show you what all this mucus really means and how it helps your body function properly because mucus, in the end, is a good thing. We need mucus. 100%, and we find mucus lining all of our respiratory tract, starting from our nose, going down into the oral cavity, going down to the upper airway, the, tra the trachea, the bronchi, and finally into the lungs. All of those structures are lined with healthy, and as we said, usually clear mucus. And of course, they serve a function, right? Very important, especially the nose. Your nose is your number one filter structure. Everything you're breathing in, the dust, the pollution, bacteria, viruses, the mucus is the first line to fight off those foreign things enter entering into your respiratory tract. So these are coming in, these foreign invaders, your mucus is trapping them. Foreign invaders. They are, and then, and then your mucus traps them, and then that's when you're sneezing, you're coughing, all that stuff's coming up. You're trying to get rid of that. That's a good thing, right? Well, and it's, that's the body's natural mechanism. You want to bring all of that stuff out. When you can't, a lot of times that's what will settle in and give you a pneumonia or a more serious infection. What we're looking at here is, is that situation that you alluded to, Dr. Travis, when that mucus becomes too thick, especially when you get it in the, in the bronchi and lower in the respiratory tract, things like bronchitis, pneumonia. And speaking of really thick mu mucus, people with cystic fibrosis have really thick mucus and it's difficult to clear pathogens. And you can imagine that if this is the kind of mucus that you're dealing with, getting it out <coughs> is not quite as easy, of course, when you do. Watch um, this. She got it out. I should, love should that. Should we do a replay of that? Uh, oh. So what we have here, as you can see, is a projectile have some fun with me. And no. that's a good thing. You want to get that out. Get it out. And, uh, of course, that's why carrying a handkerchief with you can be a, a lifesaver.